Well, this massive cruise ship will be the first to return to Norfolk after a two-year hiatus because of expensive fuel costs. City officials announced the 4,000-passenger Carnival Splendor will arrive and set sail in 2015, and that means a big boost to our economy. Center on your sides, Chris Horn is live at the Half Moon Cruise and Celebration Center in downtown Norfolk with all the details. Chris? Yes, Mayor Paul Frame says the return of Carnival will help the city's image and its bottom line. And the people and the businesses with whom we spoke this afternoon say Carnival will make Norfolk once again a civilian port of call. I mean, the timing of it is really good for us. Norfolk's mayor sees the return of Carnival Cruise Lines as a wave of economic development that stretches beyond local waters and well on to local shores. More people will be using the airport. Uh, more folks will be staying in hotels. Of course, there are you know, bus trips, there are taxi cabs, there are longshoremen jobs for longshoremen. Carnival will bring the splendor, just five years old and three football fields long, to Norfolk as its home port beginning next spring. Samantha Jackson has never been on a cruise, but now that just might change. That's very exciting because usually you have to travel and so it's really convenient. When Carnival suspended service last year because of the economy, environmental regulations, and mechanical and health problems that were plaguing cruises in general, it was the beginning of rough seas for businesses around the Half Moon Cruise and Celebration Center. What were your feelings when you heard they were suspending service last year? It felt like somebody punched us in the gut. Really? Yeah, I mean for the whole city because they don't really understand the impact that it has for us locally and regionally. The Carnival Splendor will feature five and six day cruises to the Bahamas, as well as a two day cruise to nowhere for people who want the cruise ship experience in a short time frame. The city says 20 stopover visits are already scheduled for Norfolk between now and the end of next year. And officially Norfolk will be Splendor's seasonal home port. We wanted to get the trade industry's perspective on this, so I contacted Tidewater AAA. AAA anticipates that Carnival will indeed make a big splash economically when it returns next spring. In fact, uh, the spokesperson there, Georgine Blumling, says now is the time to cruise, despite what's happened in the industry in previous years, because the industry has focused on solving its problems with people getting sick on board and with mechanical troubles out at sea. Live in Norfolk, Chris Horn, 10 on your side.